Marisa and today we are going to discuss if COVID is or is not going to free our hair accessories. The last video about COVID was in English and you guys loved it so today I'm here again to make another video in English also because COVID is a American company I think and all their statements are in English so I couldn't post the video without saying what happened today yesterday for you guys a couple of days later that COVID posted that statement about the hair accessories something happened COVID took off a result of a daily challenge and I've lost two rallies yes two why because I have two houses in two different accounts so I lost two, two rallies because of a bug that COVID fashion really like passed a lot of theories are going on over there like this happened one day after the statement and after they tell us a bunch of things that they're going to do what we ask them all the results in the rally came as zero basically it was zeroed out i lost the rally and they probably won't do anything about it this is so so weird because this already happened before with some people but never happened like in this scale i never saw so many people lost their, their rallies this is kind of scary you know i maybe they are doing this to show that they are the ones with the power really awful if they are doing this i don't think they are but kind of makes sense that they are doing this to make us quiet and forget about the hair accessories riot and everything i couldn't leave the video continue without talking about this i'm here today to analyze their last statement about the hair accessories and everything and i'm going to tell you my opinion about all of this i read a bunch of text a bunch of commentaries about this i'm here to talk about what i think about this okay so last day 14, I don't know if this is correct. They made another statement about the hair accessories fight or riot. I think they did that because of the Sarah challenge. The challenge that it's about Sarah has her picture. The most of us are entering troll looks for this challenge. I am. I made this troll look over here. Are you seeing this? I use all of the great things that we have to make our looks Like the hats that cut out middle of our hairs But instead of a hair, I use a hair accessory that we never use Like I don't know why they give us that hair accessory And it's kind of ugly So if you see my look really closely You can see that the rest of the hair accessory that wasn't cut out It's floating in the air And I use the jumpsuit that I don't know what happened actually with the jumpsuit maybe it looks like i'm going to steal covid fashion maybe to make it my own i use the bouquets on the right side or no my god it's left side i use a vest over all of it i like the vest actually i really like it i don't know when you put a vest with a jumpsuit they cut each other and i hate that butterfly wings like it's beautiful and everything but it's really useless i won't use that i don't like it it doesn't make any sense unless you are barbie butterfly so i think that scared them maybe a lot of people send the troll looks and then they were like afraid or anything or saw that a lot of people are mad with them so here is a statement i'm going to read with you guys covid community oh now it's community it's not like Women's that play COVID. We recognize that the past couple of weeks have been frustrating. Please know that we have been closely reading all of the tickets, comments, and emails regarding the hair accessory glitch. So here we have the first lie. Actually, I don't know if it is really a lie. I think it is because there's a lot of things that we have to fix. So if you are reading all of the tickets, everyone is getting their bugs fixed. Is that right? You had your bug fixed over these last few weeks. If you don't, please comment here because if they are reading all of the tickets like regarding the hair accessory. Oh, so you know which ticket is before you open it. 
I'm being bitchy right now. This has been top of mind for all of us here on the COVID team. And we deeply apologize if our initial statement came across as anything less than satisfactory. Our intention for posting was to let you know that we are aware of the issue, but we recognize we did not provide a clear path forward. Of course you are aware. COVID basically wrote a giant text saying no never gonna happen. This community is incredibly important to us and it's our goal to always be as transparent with you as possible. Such a lie. Because they never talk to us about anything. They don't even talk to us about the new things that they are going to do. Like prop store. All of the things that, that happen on the game, we know for the game. We don't know before. We don't know on Facebook. We don't receive a message. I don't think that this is correct because if you have a game with a large community like COVID, you need to post updates. You need to share them what you're doing. You need to make them excited about the game and COVID does not do that. You are the very DNA that makes COVID fashion so special. Over these last few weeks, we have been carefully considering all of your feedback and have had many internal discussions around how to best provide our players with a better experience, as well as maintain the trust you have given us over the last six and a half years. So these internal discussions are of course meetings and they are important because are the ones that are making the game but I think it would be really cool if they made these discussions with everyone so that everyone could say what they think about these changes and about the things that are not good in the game. A Brazilian group, the Unique Dynasty, posted a text about a group that existed on Facebook that allegedly COVID team made that Facebook group to talk about its own selected I don't know how no one knows COVID players to know what they were thinking about the game what changes should be made a lot of people said that COVID collection should not have a season I already made a video about it you can watch it here if you speak in Portuguese sorry I will make subtitles for that video this thing about hair accessories were also like discussed there and then something really strange happened COVID just started shutting some comments down, shut some posts down, you couldn't speak more, you can say more your opinions and then the group was just there, forgotten. In the interest of making progress towards these goals, we wanted to give you an update for where we are. First of all, I did not like the way that this was presented with asterisk. Is, is that right? I think it, it could be one, two, three, or A, B, C. It would be more professional, and this kind of looks like it was an intern. So, first, asterisk. We are currently looking into how we can enable the ability to use your own hair accessories on your unlocked hairstyles for all players as an addition to the COVID experience. Pay attention. COVID experience. Why they are saying COVID experience? Because they are not going to charge you for it. They are saying we are making this change, this huge change that are going to, of course, give you a advantage in your game because you're going to use all of your hair accessories. If you are a low level account, you can use a lot of hair accessories that you would be able to use only when you reach it like level 30. So they are not going to charge you for it. They are going to add in the all COVID experience like a feature. It's not going to be something bigger. It's going to be a feature. It's going to enter like prop store. We understand the glitch brought a whole new level of creativity to styling and we want to recreate that with a simple streamline experience. I had to search what streamline was and I found out that there was two meanings. One is organized. I don't know what kind of streamline they are saying here too. Heading into this exploration, we want to acknowledge that we may not be able to release all hair accessories on all hair styles. We saw that we can't yet use anything we want and as I said in the last video, we could pick our own combinations. Like if it's not good, okay, we don't use it. 
let's keep moving. With the glitch, the layering will look good on some hairstyles, but not all of them. Of course, there is a lot of hairstyles that are ugly. It is important to us to deliver a quality experience for all users. Please, quality experience. So now, with the hair accessories, you want to deliver us a quality experience, but with the hats and the caps. Personally, I think that they need to fix the caps, the hoods and bonnets first because girl, I never saw a art error like that. It's awful, it's ugly, it's Ugh, I hate it, this makes me so mad. We can't use a cap on our game because your hair gets like I can because this doesn't exist in the real life. To do this, we will be testing hairstyles individually on a variety of devices so that we can avoid issues such as Scrunches floating above your model or beads hovering off to the side. So baby, COVID, please. This already happened, you know. I think they are overreacting about testing hairstyles individually. If you do, it's a really quick process because it's a lot of work. And if you have a lot of people, as you showed in the video, you can make this really fast. So testing hairstyles individually, you can do in one day. And on a variety of devices, this didn't make any sense like the only thing that is different on covid and iphone on covid and android um, is the size so you, you just have to you know resize a screen <laughs> three in an effort to be more transparent we do want to set the expectation that this is a complicated technical fix so they are fixing something they are meaning the glitch or they are meaning the hair accessories that isn't a good system. Maybe this is also a mistake of my part, error of translation, but I understand it like this. So, And it will take some time to make the flow intuitive and easy to use. It is important that everyone is able to access this level of creativity for the hairstyles we, they've unlocked and the, ha the hair accessories they own. But this change does impact over 40 thousand pieces of art overreacting again there is a bunch of hair accessories that are the same they can be used in a lot of hairstyles we have shift our whole roadmap to make this a top priority they are saying this like shift our whole roadmap what was your top priority what was it was making the caps better what was your top priority we don't know if you are transparent please tell us this is the top priority you are going to make this really really fast like in a month and we'll provide updates so that you know where we are and how we are moving forward if in a month they are not posting anything any update is because they are doing nothing because a game i'm going to show you all in the end of this month i'm making a spoiler right now you have yes monthly updates on a game that you are making and this is like a top priority so everyone is going to be working on this so every month you're going to have a update to show us and, and if they don't they are doing nada your feedback is extremely valuable to us as we constantly strive to improve all aspects of the game we want to sincerely thank you for your patience girl we didn't have patience we were literally like screaming at your ears the whole time and know that we are committed to doing better as we move forward to address and work through all game issues <sighs> i don't believe it my opinion about this they are not going to address all the game issues they are if they do this if they really make the hair accessories available for all hairstyles they are done they are not going to make anything more this text didn't convince me i will only believe when the time has come and they show us that we can yes use all the hair accessories that we want on with the hairs that we unlocked i want to know what you think think that is true you think that they are going to do it please let me know in the comments down below and thanks for watching the video please like the video to help me you guys liked a lot the last video i love it and don't forget to subscribe, there will be more videos in English, so be here, don't miss a thing. Bye!